History Barbie. One, a daughter. Ruth Handler watched her daughter Barbara play with paper dolls and noticed that she often enjoyed giving them adult roles. At the time, most children's toy dolls were representations of infants. Realizing that there could be a gap in the market, Handler suggested the idea of an adult body doll to her husband Elliot, a co-founder of the Mattel toy company. He was unenthusiastic about the idea, as were Mattel's directors. 2. Travel to Europe During a trip to Europe in 1956 with her children Barbara and Kenneth, Ruth Handler came across a German toy doll called Bill Lilly. The adult figure doll was exactly what Handler had in mind, so she purchased three of them. She gave one to her daughter and took the others back to Mattel. The Lily doll was based on a popular character appearing in a comic strip drawn by Reinhard Buthen for the newspaper Build. Lily was a blonde bombshell, a working girl who knew what she wanted and was not above using men to get it. The Lily doll was first sold in Germany in 1955, and although it was initially sold to adults, it became popular with children who enjoyed dressing her up in outfits that were available separately. Upon her return to the United States, Handler redesigned the doll, with help from local inventor designer Jack Ryan, and the doll was given a new name, Barbie, after Handler's daughter Barbara. The doll made its debut at the American International Toy Fair in New York City on March 9, 1959. This date is also used as Barbie's official birthday. 3. The First Barbie The first Barbie doll wore a black and white zebra striped swimsuit and signature top knot ponytail and was available as either a blonde or brunette. The doll was marketed as a teenage fashion model, with her clothes created by Mattel fashion designer Charlotte Johnson. The first Barbie dolls were manufactured in Japan, with their clothes hand-stitched by Japanese homeworkers. Around 350,000 Barbie dolls were sold during the first year of production. Lewis Marks and Company sued Mattel in March 1961. After licensing Lily, they claimed that Mattel had infringed on Grainer and Hauser's patent for Build Lily's hip joint, and also claimed that Barbie was the direct takeoff and copy of Build Lily. The company additionally claimed that Mattel falsely and misleadingly represented itself as having originated the design. Mattel counterclaimed and the case was settled out of court in 1963. In 1964, Mattel bought Grainer and Hauser's copyright and patent rights for the Build Lily doll for $21,600. For Marketing Strategy Ruth Handler believed that it was important for Barbie to have an adult appearance, and early market research showed that some parents were unhappy about the doll's chest, which had distinct breasts. Barbie's appearance has been changed many times, most notably in 1971 when the doll's eyes were adjusted to look forwards rather than having the demure sideways glance of the original model. This would be the last improvement Ruth would make to her own creation as, three years later, she and her husband Elliot were removed from their posts at Mattel after an investigation found them guilty of issuing false and misleading financial reports. Barbie was one of the first toys to have a marketing strategy based extensively on television advertising, which has been copied widely by other toys. It is estimated that over a billion Barbie dolls have been sold worldwide in over 150 countries, with Mattel claiming that three Barbie dolls are sold every second. The standard range of Barbie dolls and related accessories are manufactured to approximately one-sixth scale, which is also known as play scale. The standard dolls are approximately 11 and a half inches, 29 centimeters, tall. Research, Vitor Hugo Lizard Leonard. About my channel of curiosities, this channel is to see and hear curiosities of our world in general, if possible leave your like and subscribe to have new notifications about new subjects, thank you very much.